Hi, I'm Brad Steno, Account Executive at r, &R Insurance Services. r, &R is different from other agencies in that we are family owned and the REACH family continues to invest in the professional resources that help better serve our customers. Here are a few of the resources that we have. My name is John Brengles. I'm a loss control specialist with r and r and I've been here 13 years. Well, I just had a client who uh, is relatively small, a lot of management people wearing different hats. We took them through a mock OSHA inspection and at the end of the day found some key items they did not have programs in, were not in compliance in, and actually some of their OSHA record keeping was also way off. So. Uh, they feel much more secure that if they get an OSHA visit in the next year, let's just say they'd be far more prepared than they were six months ago. Recently, I had a claim denial of a gymnasium floor that got wet at a school, and the carrier had hired an engineer, came in, investigated, and said that this was an old damage, kind of a leak, and I did a lot more investigation to show that that had nothing to do with it, and I was able to, to get the carrier to actually accept the claim and it saved the school district about $160,000. We uh, started a new relationship with a large commercial swimming pool uh, construction business, and they had had a partnership with a prior agent and a prior uh, workers' compensation carrier, and I was asked internally to take a look at their loss experience, and when I went through some of uh, their workers' compensation claims that had been settled and closed out, I came ac across a large claims file that was open in their workers' compensation experience mod. And the claim actually closed out at zero dollars, and the prior agent never took the opportunity to go back to the carrier and ask for the unit staff card to be refiled. We were able to save that customer $14,000 for the two years that that claim was in their experience mod. Just had a meeting with the buyer of one of our current customers, and from our uh, quarterly interactions, he really felt that we were saving a um, $100,000 claim from some of the ergonomic enhancements that they have included. Okay, we have a experience mod audit process at r, r that we are continually saving our clients money and reducing mods. We'll find claims that are open that shouldn't be open and can close and have a big financial impact on the mod. Today, for 2018, we have 1.1 million of savings. Um, recently, I successfully negotiated um, contract requirements in a uh, with a certificate holder for a certificate of insurance. Um, the holder was requiring one coverage, and we negotiated and argued that the other coverage was more appropriate for the job, the work that was being done, and we won. <laughs>